Happy freaking 4th of July, people. How's it going? Serena the Concrete Rose here. Hey, uh, I forget why I'm shooting this video. <laughs> anyway, barefoot. Barefoot on the grass. Oh, yeah, do you have your water? Does it say thank you on it? I know. Listen to your mother. Mommy Dearest came to me last night. I'm like, oh, shit. I think they made a movie out of that or whatever. <laughs> A long time ago. Anyway, why am I shooting this video? <clears throat> so I was going to the bathroom. It's when a lot of my shit comes, right? Going to the bathroom and, and children came up. Well, a lot of things came up. Um, but it had to do with children. You know, children are our future, correct? And the children that are coming up, that are being born, that are coming up are special. And you know, because when you look at them, you know they're special, right? Bless you, Isabel. Um, you know they're special. So they're going to need to be taught, right? And trained. I don't like to say trained like they're little soldier people. <laughs> but what I mean is, you know, raised New Earth style, you know? So let's get them outside barefoot. Of course, make sure there's no glass. I mean, come on, I shouldn't have to say shit like that, so I'm not gonna, anyway, because it's just absurd. I'd be like saying, um, breathe air. <laughs> but, you know, um, say, water. Thank you, I love you, water. Thank you, I love you. Thank you, I love you. And get outside and just say, you know, thank you, God. Thank you, Gaia. Thank you, Mother Earth. Thank you, trees. So I can breathe oxygen. Thank you. Stop cutting down trees that don't need to be cut down, people. Shit. Cut down towers. Fuck that. Anyway. Thank you, son, for the vitamin D. Helping our skin, our nails, and our hair grow. The birds. You know, just thank you. Thank you. Thank you, grass, for being beautiful. You know, we got to start. Thank you. I'm hugging myself. Thank you. I love you. Thank you, body. Thank you. I love you. That's what this is about. I love you. Thank you. Thank you that I'm healthy. Thank you that I'm walking. Please, thank you that I'm walking. I'll tell you what. Once you... I'm fortunate because I had my legs taken from me. Not literally, obviously, but you know what I'm saying. I got bedridden and everything. White butterfly. Hi, butterfly. You know, I love it. A bird. Um, and not being able to get up and walk and not being able to dance. I still can't dance, but you know, we take things for granted. I don't want to take things for granted anymore. I want to be grateful every single day of this beautiful world that I live in. You know? So I can walk. I can walk. That's huge. <laughs> All I know is, you know, don't miss something until it's gone. Let's try to appreciate what we have. That way we'll see more of it. That's why I'm doing this walk and talk series. And I'm scared to death. It's starting to bomb. Like, what am I going to say? How am I going to do it? Is it going to work out? Are they going to be able to hear me? Um... I don't know, all these these stupid things, but I'm just going to fucking go with it, you know? I have a whole bunch of shit written down. I've been working on a lot of things, and God's been doing hella work in me, man. In a couple of days, it's just been like, boom, boom, boom. But, because God knew I was going to fix my car, and I was fucking out of here, and I wasn't going to take time to sit, reflect. I wasn't going to reflect. I wasn't going to learn what I needed to learn. I wasn't going to gain knowledge that has been given to me so I know where I'm going. I know who I'm going to be going with if it is with somebody. You know, I mean, slow down. Surrender. I say I surrender, but obviously I really don't because uh, here I am growing pains, we'll call it. <laughs> growing pains. Yeah. Thank you, water. Thank you. Anyway, have a safe and happy 4th of July and 
the children are our future, so what better way than, you know, leading the example for the future generation for New Earth, you know? Come on now. New Earth is beautiful. You, Your children and your children's children and their children's children will get to see and live the life that we've always dreamed of and knew we were going to have. And guess what? It's here, so no more excuses. No more excuses. The veil is going away. And as we get outside and just... I got chills all over and I want to cry because it makes God happy. It makes God happy. You know? Everything that's living is a part of God. So if you want to bless God, bless yourself. That's what I just said. Bless yourself. Bless people. Be kind. Be loving. If you love yourself, you're loving God. What a concept, huh? I just keep hearing, just love yourself. Just love yourself. It, it has to start at home. At home within you. Because you are the key to the doors of your soul. You're the key. It's okay. We're going to unlock these doors. And we're going to get healthy. And we're going to get happy. And we're going to vibrate high. And we're going to do it. With such ease, you're not even going to know what's happening. That's the best part. You're not even going to know what's happening. And um, thank your food. Thank your body. Thank your cells. We're going to talk to ourselves. We're going to talk to our bodies as we're outside. Vibrating in the same vibration, you know. And having fun and getting together. And, and it's going to be great. It's going to be great. It's going to be great. Um... And hey, I'm bringing you guys along my journey and oh, you're going to hear about all my shit and all my time and who I am and where I come from and uh, things I've done, whatever, whatever. I have nothing to hide, you know, I have nothing to hide. I'm not afraid. I can admit all my shit. But anyway, man, I love you guys. Life is great. The wind is blowing. Life couldn't be better. I really couldn't. I love you. And all I could say is, let's throw this bottle down, is peace, love, and harmony.